Okay, sir, would you state your name and age? My name is Matthew Bartlett, and I am 28 years old. Mr. Bartlett, I'm going to have the court deputy show you these uh, three pictures, which will be Court's Composite Exhibit 1. You recognize the individual contained therein on that photograph, sir? Yes, I do. Okay, and who is it? This is me. Okay. And uh, what is that symbol that you are projecting with your fingers? Um, using my middle finger, and I am sorry. Okay, and, and, and what does that mean, sir, when you extend one's middle finger? The, the F word to someone. What does it mean to you, sir? Not to some, but to you. No, to, to use the, the F word to someone. And who were you extending the finger to, sir? <sighs> Mr. Ashton. And what, Mr. When, what was Mr. Ashton doing at that time, sir? I don't even know. Was Court was in session was it not yes it was now you see this sign yes sir and does not this sign read any gestures facial expressions or audible comments showing approval or disapproval during a court proceeding is absolutely prohibited uh, that sign is posted on the door outside is it not it is how far have you gone in school? 12th grade. Can you read and write? Yes, sir. Did you not read this sign, sir? I have read that. And when you came in this morning, did the court deputy uh, give you the benefit of reacquainting you with the ground rules in this proceeding about Gestures, expressions. Yes, sir. What do you recall that court deputy saying? There shall not be any gestures or facial expressions. Uh, was there anything about that that you did not understand, sir? No, no, sir. Is... Sir, pursuant to Rule 3.8, Three zero of the Florida Rules of Criminal Procedure. Could you tell this court why you should not be held in contempt of court for failing to comply with posted sign, which were posted signage and directions that were given to you orally, which this court ordered posted and required that the court deputies advise you orally why you should not be held in contempt of court for gesturing by pointing your middle index finger, which you told us is the F word, uh, to Mr. Jeffrey Ashton, who was at the podium at the time in open court while this court was present. Can you tell me any reason why you should not be held in contempt of court, sir? I'm, sure, I'm truly sorry for, for doing this. This is something stupid, and I don't even, I'm not sure why I even did it. And um, I, do, I just apologize. I, do, I don't understand why I did it. <laughs> well, there was a reason why uh, you decided to extend Mr. Ashton the courtesy of flipping him your index finger. Was he saying something that you disapproved of, or, or did you think that highly or lowly of Mr. Ashton? I, I, I don't think lowly of Mr. Ashton. Well, what did he do to deserve the middle finger? This is just some stupid thing that I did, and I, I do apologize. You recall, sir, whether or not the jury was in here when you decided to extend that courtesy to Mr. Ashton? Yes, they were. Okay. 
know what would have happened, sir, if some of the members of the jury had seen you extending your middle finger of affection to Mr. Ashton? No, I don't know. Sir, uh, would you care to present any evidence of excuse or mitigate or uh, mitigating circumstances at this time before this court imposes sentence? Can you repeat the question? Sorry. Would you care to present any evidence of excuse or mitigating circumstances that you would like this court to take in consideration prior to the court imposing sentence in this case, sir. I, I, I just apologize for doing something like this. This is just some stupid thing that I did. <clears throat> sir, uh, have you ever been convicted of a felony or a misdemeanor involving dishonesty or moral turpitude? No. Are you employed? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. And where do you work? At TGI Fridays. And which Fridays is that? That's at uh, Millennia. Okay. And what do you do there? I'm a server. Okay. Anything you would like to say before this court imposes sentence? I, I, I apologize for doing this. Young man, do you realize that the taxpayers of the state of Florida has expended a great deal of money? in putting on uh, this trial and that your actions may have jeopardized or could have jeopardized all of the work that the attorneys have done in this particular case. Yes, sir. And one of the reasons I had those signs posted and why the deputies give those remarks every day is I don't want to assume people know or should know what the proper decorum is in a courtroom. Where do you live, sir? You don't need to give me the address, but do you live alone or do you live with your parents? I live alone. At this time, I will uh, judge you to be guilty of the crime of uh, direct criminal contempt. I will sentence you to six days in Orange County Jail, impose a fine of $400 along with the applicable statutory court costs Sir, how much time will you need uh, to pay the fine? How much is the fine? It would be $400 fine, and Madam Clerk, what would be the approximate court cost? Uh, Mr. Mean, it be $223. Okay, um, I, I could pay it immediately. Okay, I will uh, give you uh, six months to have it paid. You could pay it all at once. Okay. Madam Clerk, uh, divide that total up in six months, uh, starting uh, August the 1st, uh, in equal installments for a period of uh, six payments. Sir, they will get some additional information from you, such as uh, your address and date of birth, because I'm going to need all of that to, to put in the order. Okay. 
Sir, you have a right to appeal the judgment and sentence I've just rendered in your case here today, provided you file a written notice of appeal within 30 days of the day's date with the clerk of the court. If you cannot afford the services of an attorney to assist you with the appeal in this matter, the court will appoint one to represent you. Bearing those rights in mind, and after bearing those rights in mind, sir, do you wish to appeal? Yes. For purposes of appeal, uh, sir, uh, raise your, well, you can't raise your right hand right now. You solemnly swear that testimony anybody giving this cause will be the whole truth and nothing but the truth except to God. Yes, sir. What is your uh, annual income, sir? Oh, it's um, around. Or fifteen thousand a year. Okay. Uh, how much are your average monthly expenses? They are around fifteen hundred. Okay. How much money do you have in any savings or checking account? I've got a hundred and sixty dollars in checking and about twelve dollars in savings. Okay. So, do you have any personal? property, stocks, bonds, or anything else, or real property uh, that has a value in excess of uh, $4,000? No. Okay, for purposes of appeal, I will appoint the Office of the Public Defender to represent you for purposes of appeal. He will be remanded to the custody of, the, of Orange County Sheriff's Department for transportation to the Orange County Jail. Uh, you're going to need to hold him here for about 45 minutes or an hour so I can uh, prepare the necessary order. He will be remanded. Okay, are there any other matters that we need to, uh, where are the photographs? By the user and how many times the web page was visited. 